Over the past couple of weeks, I've been making my way from trades, trading from a fake Jordan 1 Dior, and my goal by the end of the month is to get to a real $10,000 Air Jordan 1 Dior. We're about to go into the stock room and see if we can make a trade right now. Jumbo, we got some nice kicks in the building today. Do you know, right off the bat, like what's the value of this right now? Maybe a hundred bucks. We're doing another trade video. Do you have anything that you'd be willing to trade for these? Man, I think I just got something in. Let me go, let me go see what's okay. going happen. All right. I just got these in. Okay. I already got a buyer. You got a buyer? I got a buyer. But they told me to wait till this weekend. Okay. Since you're my boy, I'll let you get it first. You got to come before Friday, though. Dude, the Travis Scott Fours? Yes, sir. Are you serious? They're used, though, obviously. They're used, yeah. Bring me, bring me something about, I don't know, let's say around seven, eight hundred dollars worth. All right, bro. Done. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get these. I'm going to get these by the end of the week, bro. Gotcha. I'm going to get these by the end of the week. I'm going to be listing these on Facebook right now, see if anybody around is willing to trade, and hopefully we can get those Travis's by the end of the week. I gotta do it, let's go. So I started off day one with a pair of fake Dior's. I then traded, 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 and then I got robbed. Sir, sir, sir. But I ended up finding a lot of free stuff on Facebook, which I worked my way up to the pair of Air Jordan 3's that we have now, and I have to figure out how to trade them. Oh, and I also forgot to mention in this challenge that if I don't trade shoes only from fake Dior's to real Dior's by the end of the 30 days, I'm gonna give away the most expensive shoes in my collection worth $30,000, my Nike Air Max. I just got an offer from a lady who's really angry at her husband because of something he did. I really don't care, but I saw he had a pair of New Balance 550's, which I think could be worth something. Let's go find out. Dude, where is this? Where is this lady? It is so hot in Texas. We've been waiting like 20 minutes in this spot. She's saying she can't find parking. I don't know what's going on right now. It's really hot out here, but we'll see. We'll see if she comes. We, we don't have time to waste. We gotta go. All right, we got a trader. We got a trader. Hi, Marla. Hey, Tim. Hi, nice to meet you, Tim. It's so good to meet you. Are those the shoes? Oh my God, yes. I want these for my husband for Father's Day. Oh, those are nice. But Those you are know so what? In person. He's an asshole. Really? Yeah, he, I caught him in bed. I want to get rid of these shoes. Please, let's trade. Okay. Um, and what, what what made you want the Jordan 3s instead? Dude, can you imagine these on me? I mean, they're not really, but jealous. yeah. They're, they'll make him jealous? Yeah, because he knows I got him those, and I'm going to end up with these. So I, how much how much did you pay for these? I think they were like somewhere around 150 150 Okay, yeah. and they're brand new? Never been warm. Wow, never these are been out of the box. so nice. Let me check out the other pair. Other pair looks great as well. The color is just insane. The blue color on here. That's what he liked about him. Yeah. You know what? F him. You just you're mad at I'm him. I'm done. If you want those, I mean, I'm good to I'm good to trade if you want. You wanna go with them? I'm you're sorry. Look, I'm sorry about your. You're the best. I'm sorry about your husband. Um, oh my god. Don't be sorry. Well, Thanks. Enjoy those. Have a go. That was probably the weirdest trade I think we've ever done, bro. She said she caught her husband, but I mean. It was meant to be, because we got some new balances that are worth like 150 now. Let's go, let's go. So time to post these bad boys right now on to Facebook Marketplace and see if anybody wants some really, really fresh, super clean new balances. I feel like we're gonna get something good. Okay, we're out here right now. We posted the new balances. There's an older man that wants them, okay? And when he reached out to us on Facebook, he was like, I have something really, really special for you guys. He didn't want to tell me what it was, which it could be something super crazy, like a Jordan, that Jordan wore or something, or it could just be like something weird. Hey, how's it going? Good, how you doing? Tim, nice to meet Mark, you. Mark, how you doing? Good, good, good. I said that I was looking for a trade for these. You're a big New Balance guy? These are awesome. Yeah? Damn. I think they'll suit you. I think they'll suit you. The, the blue color was really good. The lady we got them from, you know, she loved the shoes. She was buying for her husband for Father's Day, but she said that her husband like, cheated on her or something so she ended up getting rid of these uh but you know we came out here because you said you got something special i have no idea what you have but i really hope it's something good i've got the pair for you these things are freaking phenomenal okay Yo. ready for this yeah let's check ready out. for this let's check out. these things are freaking rock and roll look at these things man that's crazy are those the rick and Mort dude those are the rick and morty's yep that is insane. Those things are freaking. Yo, the new, the, they won't the miss Puma. You for a long time. The Puma huh. New Balances, bro. Look at how crazy these are. And they're in brand new condition as yeah. well. That is insane. I think these are like sold out everywhere too. That's crazy. Yeah. These shoes are like worth, I think they're actually going up in value too. Dude, well here, check these out. Check these out real quick. Yeah, these are those new New Balance uh, Carolina Blues. Right, right, right. Yeah. Cool, I mean, I do. I honestly, I really want these if you want to trade. Sure. Okay. 
Sounds great, man. Sounds Thanks good. so much. Thanks for coming out. No Appreciate problem. it. Thank you. Have a good day. Yeah, thank you. I told myself I wasn't going to work on Sundays. I wasn't going to film or trade or anything like that because I just got out of church when I got the message. But, but I think retail is about $140, $150. And I've been seeing these going on StockX. $180. So I think that this takes us to a whole other level. Starting off Monday morning, great. You know what they say. The beginning of the week determines how the rest of your week's going to be. And I got an offer that is too good to be true. I got a pair of white cements, the white cement three reimagine that somebody wants to offer for the Pumas, which I think is absolutely insane because I don't even have my pair yet, but let's go meet it, meet her up and see if this is too good to be true or not. Hey, how's it going? Sam? Uh, yeah. Hi. Nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. Tim. Okay. So are those them? Yeah, these are them. Sure. I actually originally, uh, originally I got them for myself, but... Uh, oh my gosh. Not... The white cement? Yeah. These are sick. Oh my gosh. So, okay, tell me the story. Like, why are you, so, why are you trading the white cements for like the Rick and Mortys? So actually, I've been looking for those for my boyfriend friend and I couldn't find them anywhere and then I saw them and I was like Yo, you have to let I, them know. I like these you have are to get them. compared to those right okay yeah, I mean so, did you want to check them out or anything these uh, are brand new so for real yeah they're like, like not even new. worn never worn yeah I have no idea dude he would love these yeah oh my god yeah are they the right size they're 12 yes perfect okay cool sure you want to do the trade yeah okay all right well enjoy those thank you so have much. a good one yeah, thank you, you. We just got a white cement. That was a crazy trade. Are they real? Hold on, did she give us? So we quickly drove to the stockroom to find out if they were real or not. Yeah, they just mass produce them so much. You'll see a whole bunch of glue stains, but that's regular these days. Yeah, these are real. These are legit. Back downtown now, a lot of people wanted these because these are the hype shoe right now, but I got a message from a guy named John who says he has the lost and founds and is willing to trade these, which doesn't make sense because John is has an adult size in the lost and found and these are a youth size in the cement threes. So we're gonna see, we're gonna make it happen. If we end up getting lost and founds, that's a major jump. And you guys gotta leave a thumbs up for sure if we do this. Hey John. What's going on, man? How's it going, man? Tim. Tim. Those are them? Man. Dude, the lost, lost and found. Dude, so sick, man. Can I check them out? Show them to me. Yeah, Dude, oh my gosh, dude, those are freaking Great amazing. Claim. Are they used? No, not used, not touched at all. Okay, because they looked a little like creased and like used and stuff. That's the style, man, that's how, that's how it goes. Really? Yeah. Even the creases on there? Even the creases, yeah, that's all vintage crease. Okay, I don't I don't know, I mean, it looks like even the bottom was worn. That's how they're supposed to be? Yeah, so uh, Mikey makes them now, dude. Really? Like, I know the cracking and stuff, but like, there's like actually creases on them and this is how like I the bought them new from the store. I don't know. You bought them new from the store like that? Yeah. Is that really just a style? That might just be the style. The paper might be wearing off of them. They've been in the box for a while, you know? So you never worn these? I've never worn these. Um, and how much did you pay for these? Or how much would you say the value is at? Uh, I would say the value is probably like around 500 right now. 500? Yeah. Okay, okay. I love that. Yeah, so I got these white cement threes that you really wanted. You seem super excited on online, so. Okay. They're brand new, actually, brand new. Um, and they kind of have the same look, but they're not dirty, dirty. Like they have like that kind of like cream colorway on the back and on the bottoms and stuff. That's nice. Yeah. What size are these? There's a size five Y. See, I'm more of a 11 and a half, you know, so yeah. I don't know if we're really like Oh, but I, oh, but I, I listed them online as five Y though. Did you, I mean, the listing should have said. I got so excited just seeing that I didn't even check the size, but. Uh, oh, dude, I'm, so they're not going to fit you then. No, honestly, I don't think it's going to be a problem at all. Dude, like. As good as these look, I'm willing to make a trade. Are you sure? Yeah, I'll make it happen. Man. Cool. Well, thanks for coming out, dude. Appreciate Likewise. it. Thank yeah. you. Here you go. Cool, man. Have a good one. Likewise. Dude, there's no way. These are definitely yeah. used. These are definitely used, bro. I don't know. I feel like it was. they got the receipt in there and everything that it came with Nike, but yeah, dude, these are definitely like, there's no way. That's like actual dirt on them. It's like actual dirt. I think we ended off today with a really, really nice pair, especially since we started from nothing last episode. Like the video right now, because it's only gonna get crazier from here. Hopefully, I'll trade these for some heat tomorrow. Okay, so don't mind my morning hair. I just woke up, but I woke up to the most amazing and crazy offer that you guys are never gonna believe, okay? This is really good trade bait. So a lot of people want the lost and found. It's the shoe of the year, but we got somebody that has the lucky green 13s. I understand, you're like, the lucky green 13s, Depending on when you're watching this, the lucky three, the, 13, the lucky three ones, I said 13s, the lucky three ones don't come out for a couple more weeks, which is insane, but I think we're gonna get them today, and that's gonna be incredible because everybody's gonna want those before they release. So let's go downtown to the mall and see if we can trade these and see if we got it. Yo, how's it going? Good, how are you? Are those the lucky green 13s? This is them, man. Oh my gosh, let me check them out. Check them out, check them out. Dude, those are sick. Right? How, okay, let me, I gotta ask you this though. How did you get your hands on these? Like, obviously, they're not fakes, right? So, no, I 
me. How did you get your pet early? I got the hookup. My cousin works at the locker room. Really? And I told him those are the ones that I wanted. And how much how much do you think these are worth right now? I'd say at least five fifty. Five fifty? Mm -hmm. Okay, are these are the lost and found if you want to check them out. Nice. Super sick? Yeah. Yeah, and honestly. Those are gonna retain value once these release, like, you know, the value's gonna go down, obviously. But I think, like, if I can manage to use these in my trading, we can value them at 650. I'll get the win, you'll get the win. I think it's a good trade. Yeah, I think so. You wanna do it? Let's do it. Okay, sounds good. So great meeting you. Enjoy your day. All right. Get home safe. Thanks. Lucky Green Ones early pair. This is the first ever early pair in the trading series. Okay, Lucky Green 13s, boys. I'm about to post these right now. I genuinely cannot believe that we actually bought these, dude. Because like literally, there was no hope in getting my hands on these if somebody didn't have them. Nobody has these right now. So I think we're gonna get like some really, really nice trade bait for them. I'm not really, I'm not gonna go light on these though. I need an expensive shoe and it might take a while. It might happen quick, but we're getting something really good for these. Yeah, so these, I mean, when I tell you it's brand new, I'm saying it is brand new. And I know that yours are like a little bit worth more, but nobody's gonna have these right now. That's the thing. Okay, perfect. All right, all right, bye. So we came back down because somebody really wanted the Lucky Green uh, ones. They just like having things early. They got a pair of Union 4s that they're willing to trade. That could really end off this video right now because if we can get those Union 4s, we can take them back to Jumbo and I think we might be able to get those Travis Scott 4s. So it took me a couple days, but I think we're gonna make this work. Yo, Daryl. Nice to meet What's you, up, man? Nice to meet you, bro. Are nice those them right there? Yeah, these are them, man. They just been sitting. I don't want them to go to waste. Oh, sick. Or somebody who can value them, you know Bro, what I mean? let me check these out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't really want to be on camera. Oh, okay. No, we can we can blow out your face if that's cool, because we're All filming right. for a YouTube series. So these have just been sitting. They're brand new. I haven't worn them. Not even a day, bro. Still got the tag on them. That's crazy, bro. And so why are you getting rid of these? Well, I want some collector, somebody who cherished them, who will take good care of them to rock them, you know what I mean? Yeah, for sure. So these are the lucky greens, bro. Brand new, don't release for a couple weeks. You're gonna be the only one that has these on your feet. Okay. You're gonna be the only one. I can rock, can definitely rock these, man. These definitely are my size can. too. Oh yeah. So what are you thinking, man? You wanna do the trade or what? Let's go ahead and do it, bro. You wanna do it? Let's do it. Okay, bro. I appreciate you coming out, man. And yeah, this is man. fire. Okay, dude. Yo, by the way, where'd you get these from? I got a some couple of shoes from an abandoned storage building, and those are the flies one I seen in that building. They were just sitting in a storage unit? Mm -hmm. what? I bought them all out. All right, well, thanks, man. Have a good one. Have a good one, brother. We should lock down the unions right here. These things easily seven, eight hundred dollars. This is our goal of the video. Oh, dude, Jumbo's gonna have to trade me those Travises. And honestly, I would keep these for the next trade, but I feel like those Travises are still worth more, even though his are used and these are new. So we're gonna take him back to the shop and see if he wants to trade. All right, boys, just got to stock room. We don't have too much time, honestly, just because I really hope he has those Travises. Jumbo, I got some heat for you, bro. I'm ready to trade. I've got something for you, bro. We got some Union 4s. These are worth at least about seven, eight hundred dollars, bro. Brand new, exactly what you wanted. You got those Travis Scotts for me? I got something for you. Hold on. Okay. Oh my gosh, guys. Yo, I think we might have. I think we might have got him. I think we might have got him. Let's go. Let's freaking go, boys. Let's go. Here you go, bro. Dude, stop playing with me, bro. What do you mean? Stop yeah. playing with me, dog. Powder blue threes, use. That's what we agreed on. Jumbo, we didn't. What are these, dude? These are only. Bro, you're, these are these are for sale for two hundred and fifty dollars. That's what you agreed, dude. Bro, you told me, dude, you told me Travis Scotts. That's why you said get something for eight hundred, and you trade me the blue Travis Scott fours. You said Travis Scott. Did that guy come and pick him up? Yeah. You should have called me, bro. I did. I've you didn't answer, bro. All right, bro. We're gonna have to just get going then. See you later, bro. Come on, Tim. Let's do the trade. No, 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 no trade here, bro. See you later. Yeah, hold on. I think get one other pair in. Hold on. Bro, I don't have time for these games, bro. We gotta go. We gotta. I know you're busy. How about we do it for these? Man, you're the best, bro. You know, I'm mad at my word over here at Stockholm, baby. I appreciate you, bro. We got a pair of Travis Scott fours, used, but I think these are worth like a thousand dollars. From here on, we're gonna head out to LA and we're gonna trade up because we need expensive shoes now to get those Dior's. 